The following program is produced and sponsored by you, the TBN Partners, and is only made possible through your generous support. And now, Behind the Scenes International Report with TBN founder and president Paul Crouch. Join us for Paul's Around the World Daily Report to you, our partners. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. Did you know, by the way, welcome behind the scenes. <laughs> did you know that every miracle that Jesus performed in his earthly life and ministry had already been performed by God the Father in the Old Testament? Hmm. Interesting. Raising the dead? Yes, yes, sir. The the loaves and fishes or multiplying food? I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna tease you a little bit. Wow. In fact, if you'll go to Second Kings <laughs> chapter four, verse forty-two, I'll just give you a minute or two to go get your Bibles. Did you know that God, even in the Old Testament, mm -hmm. multiplied food. The food for this happens to be for the sons of the prophets. This was Elisha. Hmm. Um, we've already talked about how Elisha raised the, um, uh, the, the little Shunammite sure. That's right. woman's son from the dead. That's correct. So uh, we know that he raised the dead. Hmm. And now then, uh, this is very interesting. I've just been looking all through the Word. And do you know what, dear friends? It is. It's, did you know this book is an amazing adventure? Mm -hmm. It really, really is. Get you, uh, the old King James is good, but get you a living Bible or the new living translation or one of the new, mm -hmm. and, and compare that. You know, in fact, we're offering mm -hmm. A, a Bible right now. I think if I think you, you need we need a little gift of about a hundred bucks or so, mm -hmm. but it's really two Bibles in one. It's the old King James side by side with the new. It's right there. TV oh, in parallel. Here, here it is. Here it is. I forgot. Yes, here it is. It's the King James version along with the New Living Translation mm -hmm. uh, side by side, so you can read what the King says. Yeah. And then you can see how the new modern translators uh, translate the same. The same. Let me let me have that for a second. But I mean, as you've read the Bible and studied your whole life, you, you're learning things new oh, every day. Is that true? Absolutely true. Yeah. That's, you never exhaust. That's correct. This uh, amazing, amazing book, and it's because. Did, did, do you want me to just blow your mind a little bit? Please, I'm ready. Do you really realize what you're holding in your hand there? Well, the, the sacrifice of, no. uh, of millions. Oh, no. That. No. You've missed the whole thing. Yeah. You are holding. I can hardly say this mm. without weeping. Mm -hmm. But you know, we live in a three dimensional world height, width, and width depth. And depth. Mm -hmm. And they say that, what, the fourth dimension, I guess, is time. Sure. Jim, what's the fifth dimension? Hmm. Did you know that fifth dimension is right here? Sure. The present. No. Mm -hmm. It's in your hand mm -hmm. right here. Mm -hmm. This word doesn't come from our dimension right. at all. It comes from that fifth dimension. I am holding mm -hmm. in my hand. Oh, if, if you'll ever let this hit mm. bottom I, no, I in your you. spirit, I, I'm, I'm following you. You are holding in your hand the words, words of God, of the living God. That's right. Whoever created heaven and earth <laughs> and all that is therein. Now, uh, no, the, the leather and the paper and the ink is not of, the, it's of this world, but the Word. Right. Oh, God. Yeah. If you'll ever let that hit bottom, hmm. 
in your soul and you realize, my God, I'm holding mm -hmm. the very Word of the living God. That's right. Wow. In my hand. Mm. Oh. It's like trying to comprehend space and being infinite good. space. That's a good, a good illustration, or a very good illustration. Or that time is, is infinite. Time never ends and will never if, end. Exactly. There's, there's just certain things exactly. that we as humans just can't wrap our brains around at times. No. And, and this book, mm -hmm. you, you will never, you'll never exhaust exactly. it. Exactly. You can't. I agree. You can't. It's infinite. I, I agree. But if you will turn with me. Mm-hmm. To Second Kings chapter four, verse forty-two. This won't take but a minute. In fact, let's get our phones ringing right off the. Sure. We're live. Uh, we're, we're live, live at five, dear folks. And there's my sweet little sweet angel partners. They're waiting for your calls. Did you know we're now going through the final, final, final phases on some of our stations of the conversion from the old analog mm -hmm. into digital mm -hmm. and um, a, a few of our stations they didn't the new ones that we just bought the one in Denver Colorado mm -hmm. for example isn't really on the air yet because they didn't even give us an analog yeah we have to there we just it's a flash cut and we'll just we'll on the what June June twelfth. June twelfth, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, we're waiting for that analog to go dark so we can light so up. So we can light up and then hello Denver. We'll That's be right. there full power. That's right. Anyhow. Uh and we're gonna show you a little roll in that will explain that a little bit better, but let me just let me just show you something. a, a little diamond. Please. Go. That I found, and I'm reading from the the Living Bible, Second Kings, S Second Kings, chapter four, verse four, forty-two. Okay. It says, "One day, a man from Belshazzar, <laughs> hmm. hard hard to hard to pronounce that word, Belshazzar, brought the prophet Elisha a sack of fresh corn." Mm -hmm and twenty individual loaves of barley bread made from, oh, ho, ho, the first fruits, fruits. Yeah. of his harvest. Mm -hmm. This man knew the blessing of God that comes to anyone who obeys the Word of God because God says, the first of everything is mine. The firstborn of your mm -hmm. flocks, mm -hmm. the firstborn of your now your sons and your daughters and those that are born in, you, they have to be redeemed with the Lamb, which of course was another beautiful picture of, of the Lord Jesus mm -hmm. Christ. But, and, and, and the reason, and, and I've never heard anyone preach this, mm -hmm. the reason the first of everything God says is mine, mm -hmm is because when he delivered the children of Israel out of Egyptian bondage, mm -hmm. how did he finally do it? Tell me. He killed the firstborn first born. of sure. every thing from, right. from man to, to the firstborn of mice. That's correct. The firstborn <laughs> of everything died. Yes. And in Exodus chapter 13, read it for yourself. God says, now then the, the first of everything is mine. Okay. Got it. Okay. And by the way, here's, here's, a, here's a little, this could be a little negative key if you want. Mm -hmm. Can I jab you with a little please, something here? Please, I can take it. If you don't give him your first... He can curse you. He'll take it anyway. anyway. That's right. He sure did with the Egyptians, didn't sure. he? That's right. Hmm. You better get on the <laughs> phone. In fact, dear God, I was a phone here. I want to get on the phone myself. <laughs> oh, dear Jesus. Use my cell phone. <laughs> okay, anyway. <clears throat> uh, my little sweet partners are waiting for a call. We're, we're going to... We're, we're, 
did you know that you'll be able to watch all five of our beautiful domestic networks sure. through the air free if you'll just get the little black box mm -hmm. and if you're, or if you get you a new TV set with a, a tuner on it. You know, I, I've told this story. It was kind of cute. I was setting up a TV upstairs in my house. This has been six, seven, well, probably six years ago. And I was putting rabbit ears on it. Yeah. And Brandon, my son, who was 16 or 17, <laughs> walked in. He goes, what, what, are you, what are you doing? What in the world are you doing? He sa I said, I'm setting up a TV, you know, and we're going to watch it over the air. And he goes, dude, TV is wireless? Are you kidding me? And he had no idea as a teenager growing up oh, that, that, blows me. that TV came free through the air. And people just don't realize that anymore. But if you'll get a new TV set with a digital tuner, or like you said, the little black box, if you yeah. want to keep your old TV, you can get five channels for the price of one, so to speak. Free. Free. Through the air. And the good news is, you know, the, old, the, the problem in the old days was... If you put an outdoor antenna, it, it had to look like a <laughs> yeah, it was. A, a huge, big thing, and the and most of the CCNRs yeah, uh, you know, wouldn't permit you to put it up. But now, the antenna that you need now is just a little silly. You can hang it under the eaves. That's correct. Of your house, it CCNRs don't even yeah matter. You can't anymore. even see them anymore. Anyway, cool. where was I? Well, are you going to go to this was, roll-in about was, digital stations? No, I was, I was going to talk to. I was going to talk about this man from Belshazzar, please, who brought the prophet Elijah a sack of fresh corn and twenty individual loaves of barley bread made from the first fruits okay. of his harvest. Elisha then told Gehazi, his servant. <clears throat> to use it to feed the young prophets. <clears throat> what? Hmm. Gehazi exclaimed. Feed 100 men with only hmm. this? It's good. Question mark. But Elisha said, Go ahead, for the Lord says there will be plenty for all. And some will even be left over. Wow. <laughs> Verse 44. And sure enough, there was Plenty. just as the Lord had said. Mm -hmm. Plenty for all and some left over. He brought his first fruits That's in good. obedience to the Lord and God <laughs> multiplied it. Just like he did for Jesus many thousands of years later when Jesus fed Jesus fed 5,000 mm -hmm. with the little boys, what, two fish and yeah. five, five loaves five of loaves. bread. Mm -hmm. But here we see, even in the Old Testament, That's God performing these amazing miracles <laughs> to, do you know why he does it? He does it to boost our faith. Sure. To let us know he really knows us. He knows where we are. Mm -hmm. He knows. He knew that there was a hundred men, hundred schools of the prophet men there that needed to eat. Yeah. So he sent a man in with five barley loaves, yeah. his first fruits, and he fed the whole bunch. Mm -hmm. You know, I've heard that story even today in modern times. I remember a, a family that had made a pot of stew for their family that evening. They were mm -hmm. a Christian family, one pot of stew. All of a sudden, the whole youth group from their church comes over unexpected. <laughs> and they didn't, they felt bad. They didn't want this. There were 40, 50 kids that came over unexpected. Mm -hmm. And sure enough, this family, and, and I've heard this story told on, on praise, they started dipping the stew yeah. for, the, for this youth group. And by the end of the night, every one of those 50 kids had eaten their fill of stew and they went back to the pot and it had gone, hardly gone down at all. And I, God's still in the miracle business, oh, I believe. I believe that just as much as I believe anything. Good. Oh, it's wonderful, <laughs> wonderful. Okay, will you help us convert our stations over to digital? We're, we're doing that right now. It's costing costs about a million dollars a station. That's correct, times 36. Yeah. That's 36, 36 million. Most of them have been converted already, so 
don't faint. Just get up <laughs> and get to the phone and say, let's put the final touch on everything. And let's also send some more of those digital receivers and the little dishes over to Egypt. We're going to take you to Egypt in a minute, if the Lord gives me enough time here. Come on. Get your first fruits in right now. The They're calling. Sweet partners are on the phones right now. Okay, take take a look at me with me right now at the digital stations conversion. It's happening even as we speak. For over 30 years, a key vision of TBN has been for new stations across America and around the world. God has provided many opportunities, and with the help of you, our partners, we've been able to build or acquire literally thousands of full, medium, and low power stations. With our newest full power station, WSFJ in Columbus, Ohio. As technology has changed with the move to digital broadcasting, our vision has enlarged to not only build new stations, but to put entire new networks on the air. These networks originally launched on cable systems or direct-to-home satellite systems. First, the church channel, highlighting great worship services around the world. Then, in Los A, USA, a Spanish language network. Followed by JCTV, a network for younger adults. And our newest network, Smile of a Child, for our youngest viewers. Five full networks, each spreading the gospel in their own way. 24 hours a day, seven days a week, all part of the digital transformation. The Spirit of the Lord is upon you, for He has anointed you. But I do know our God, and He's bigger than anything that you're facing. Jesus is el Señor para gloria del Padre. I think that when we really become comfortable in sharing our faith is when we get to a point where Jesus becomes very real to us. God wrote His commandments in stone so that we could write them on our hearts. The FCC has mandated that all full-power television stations in the U.S. convert to digital broadcasting. And most of our stations have already been converted. Digital TV has many benefits. Besides a clear, crisp picture, it provides us with the ability to multicast. That is to send out all five of our networks over the air free of charge. If you live under the pattern of one of our digital stations and have a digital tuner and television, you're able to pick up all five of our networks over the air. New opportunities continue to open up for new stations in areas large and small. However, new stations and networks are expensive and the cost of converting every station to digital broadcasting is staggering. But the rewards are, oh, so great. Each digital station is now like five lighthouses, shining the light of Jesus to a world in darkness. Together, through the light of Christian television, we can make a difference in the lives of millions of souls. Call now and support new stations. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Ah. Uh. My son, my son. Now you see what kind of the engineering department's been doing for the last eight <laughs> years. Is, True. And, and really, we have been working on this for, for at least seven, eight years. Yeah. And, and we're almost done. June 12th is now the final, final deadline. All analog goes dark June 12th, and uh, we will be converted over. But if you get a, a new TV set with a digital tuner, or you get a little converter box at a $60, $70 little converter box, you, you get all of the stations. There's a lot of information. In fact, if you go to TBN's website, just www.tbn.org, uh, you see the home page. There's a thing called DTV Answers. Don't lose the TBN signal June 12th. If you click on that, it'll actually take you to some really, really good information, how to get a converter box, all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Surely our government won't postpone it again, uh, no, they? No, they, they, I, just, <laughs> they can't, can no. they? So June 12th is it. Is it. it. Final drop dead. D-Day. Yeah. And a lot of our stations have already transitioned, as you know. Oh, I know. And a few are still waiting, but yeah. we're getting close. Our time is gone. I, I think we're going to have to just, uh, how long is our little mission drill in? It's about three minutes. About three minutes. Okay. Uh, get on the phone. I'll, I'll tell you in a minute about 
a book that you just will want in your library. If you love the message and the ministry and the wonderful, amazing odyssey of Arthur Blessed, mm -hmm. you're going to want to want to get this book. It's our love gift this month of March. March. Good. So uh, get to the phones. Let's, let's take a look. Get on the phone even as we take a final look here at what we're up to as far as the kingdom of God is concerned. The gospel of Jesus Christ is being heard around the world. Beginning with our first foreign station in Nevis, TBN has exploded to the ends of the earth. Can I ask how many, how many of you are able to watch our telecast on TBN? Berapa yang nonton TBN? I cannot believe this is amazing here. New doors have opened in China and India for TBN to tell billions about the saving power of Jesus. I will sing your praises. Aur main teri stuti karunga. Oh Lord God above all gods. We love you. God bless you. Hum aapse pyar karte hain Prabhu aapko aashish de. Our satellite center in Madrid, Spain, beams the good news all over Europe. And our production center in Milan, Italy, sends programming to Italian-speaking people around the world. TVN also airs programming on affiliated stations in Russia, Iceland, Norway, Holland, and Spain. TVN's healing channel preaches the gospel in Arabic throughout the Middle East. The healing... Hallelujah. Arabic language channel Yay. is on the air. Thank you, Jason. <laughs> and the new Najat TV network covers Iran and the Middle East in the Farsi language 24 hours a day. This is TBN Najat, which means salvation. TBN Salvation TV in the Farsi language. South Africa is reached by another network of TBN stations. One more time, just for Paul and Jane Crouch. Everybody that watches TBN here in the East Cape, wave at me right now. Look at that. Keep waving. And TBN programs air in Central African countries such as Uganda, Zambia, and Kenya. Now all we need in all of our stations in Africa is one of these big, I call them the big catcher mitt, the big receiving dish that will pick up the double hopscotch jump from California all the way to Nairobi. You'll have live, praise the Lord now. The powerful Enlace satellite sends Spanish language programming all over Latin America and Spain, reaching hundreds of stations in Central and South America. The Caribbean is covered with TBN stations and affiliates in Neva, St. Lucia, Grenada, Puerto Rico, and the Cayman Islands. Radio Paradise reaches the Caribbean and beyond with Christian Radio, and KTBN Super Power Radio covers the world. Additional satellites take TBN live to Australia, New Zealand, the South Pacific, and Asia. Now that the door to China is finally open, the entire world is hearing the good news that Jesus saves and is coming again. Rejoice, rejoice, rejoice that the gospel has now come by Christian television, literally to the end of the world. Jesus said, go into all the world. That time has arrived. Be a part of this amazing harvest of souls. Call now and pledge for the whole wide world. Yes, 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 yes. There are many ministries who say <laughs> we are reaching the masses. We are reaching the million. How many have you seen with hands raised, 50,000, 100,000, a million hands, all waving, yes, we can see TBN. You're, you're not going to get ornery again, are you? I'm getting a little ornery, right, yes, I well, am. Okay. I, I get a little irked, actually. <laughs> at the, you know, these people, they, they claim we're, we're going to all the world. We're going, yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> right. Just tell people to call in. This is just, good. Just... TBN be, be nice. is going to Amen. all the world with the gospel That's of correct. Jesus Christ. That's correct. Oh, my sweet angel partners, they're waiting for your call. Come on. <laughs> Let's buy some more dishes. Let's buy some more receivers. Hey, I got three lines open. I got five lines open. Get on the phone right now. Come on. 
let's tell the world Jesus loves you. Amen. And we'll be sending you Arthur Bless's beautiful book, The uh -huh. Cross, for your love gift, large or small. Good. Steve Brock. I think I hear him out there I somewhere. I too. I believe he's warming up. <laughs> and the great worship medley will take us out with our love. God bless you. Amen. Come on, sing it with me, everybody. Almighty God, all around the world sing, there is none like you. I worship you, oh, Prince of Peace, that is what I want. beginning and the end. Be glorified.